Now we are still watching the Gulf of Mexico through the weekend and early next week for some development. The good news is the National Hurricane Center is still not being very aggressive. The models are not being aggressive here, so it still looks like development remains somewhat uncertain. Couple different things we're watching. The Bay of Campeche down here. We may see some weak low pressure form down there in the next few days out here in the Northwest Caribbean, a disturbance lifting to the north. So all this coming together more than likely for some broad low pressure in the Gulf of Mexico. You can see that tropical moisture. There's our tropical moisture today and tomorrow. But once we get into the weekend, really the Gulf of Mexico is the hot spot for those tropical rains. This is when we likely start to see that low pressure form and then watch low pressure slowly coming together through the weekend and early next week and then getting pulled towards Florida as that weak cool front drapes down upper level trough begins to pull this all to the east and we get some nice dry air through next week. So with this type of setup, we would not see a lot of rain locally through the weekend and early next week. Now tomorrow and Thursday or to Thursday and Friday, the shower is not really associated with that disturbance itself, but you can see there through the weekend through early next week, a lot of the rain falling in the Gulf and then spreading off towards Florida. So I think Florida is probably where we see some of our higher totals and notice we're right on that dividing line of where we could see some higher rain totals, but really slow development through the Gulf and pushing off towards Florida seems to be like the best trend at this moment uh, with the forecast. Elsewhere, we've still got Kirk. It is now a hurricane, a category one in best 91. Kirk is expected to become a major storm here in the next day or so. It continues to intensify and then curving out the sea, missing all land. So good news there. Uh, behind that is future Leslie. This could travel a little bit closer to the islands in the next seven days. Certainly want to keep an eye on that for the Caribbean islands, but really doesn't look like there's a chance of that getting into the Gulf the way it looks right now. So our seven day enjoy today. It's beautiful 89 and sunny passing showers tomorrow, watching for locally heavy rain at times, along with some gusty winds with showers. Still a few showers, rumbles of thunder on Friday, and then once we get into the weekend, I do think there will be a couple of showers on Saturday, but things trending drier through the end of the week. And then next week, waiting on that weak front to arrive. It's not going to bring chilly temperatures, but should bring nice weather through the middle of next week.